walking i'm walking and uh wish me luck because don't want them to find out that I'm, I'm filming them otherwise i'm going to be in big 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 trouble so i'm hiding my camera so this is like a spy shoot and uh very dangerous but i just want you to see how people are living in the hood you know and to them it's normal it is really really terrible so just look around just look around no social distancing nothing 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 like that they don't even know that they should be social distancing one or two people are wearing masks no one has gloves no sanitizers anyway it's it's a market and we all know what a market is like it's a breeding breeding ground for for diseases like this so it's terrible it hasn't been detected yet no one has been found to have had uh, corona th this side but i'm just praying that no one will ever get it this side because if they do and they come to this market chances are 90 percent of all these people will have it and it's going to be like a boomerang effect so it's really really terrible i just hope things will improve and government will put more measures so that things like this doesn't have to happen like this at least they practice social distancing and they practice you know hygiene and they wear their masks and i think the main problem is i don't think they believe that this disease is there because if they did and if they really really knew what this disease is doing out there they would be behaving like this i'm telling you this is the part where they when you ask them they say ah there's nothing like that or it's a white man's disease or it's the wealthy people's disease you know and it scares me it shakes me to my bone i really 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 don't 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 like what i'm seeing right here and at the end of the day you can't blame them as well uh, for for you know going to the market because that's their way way of living that's how they survive that's how they make their money all these people don't go to work so how are they supposed to survive i just hope the government had you know measures to educate these people more awareness measures how this disease you know uh, affect and applies and, and transmit so that people are aware this shows that they are not aware or they don't care i i, I don't know anymore but things like this really sh shakes me to the bone and I'm really scared. I'm really, 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 really scared. And it's normal. It's like it doesn't exist. That's what really sh shocks me. Sure. I just pray that God really, really help us here. Because things are really terrible. Yo, guys, I just gotta wait, make my way out before they catch me. Because if they do, I will be in big trouble. I, and I'm not really going to like it. So I've taken my chance. You've really seen what it's like and how people are behaving out there. So I hope, I really hope that uh, things really change and they get a cure or a, a vaccine or something so that people don't die. Because really people are, are, are really going to, 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 to suffer because of this. Alright guys, I'm, I'm going and... Uh, 
I hope, I really hope that it helps. Uh, I don't know if you can see, and this is the scary part of what's happening here. It's really terrible. People have no mask, people have nothing, and they are not taking this COVID-19 uh, disease seriously. So, yeah, I don't know what's going to happen if it's like this. This place is going to be like Wuhan, again, Wuhan market. It's terrible. It's, it's really terrible.